All right, let's continue on here with level 34. <clears throat> Which yokai will it be? Um, is this Kruger? Or there's another name. I think Kruger is the other color, so. I remember one of them, but not the other one. All right. Let us begin. Kruger and I think the butterflies on the sides are either Enna flies or... Can't remember. And a fly is the only name that I remember off the top of my head. I'm definitely still getting better with this though, because there are some yokai that I used to just totally not know the name of at all. When I started playing this, I was like, oh, which yokai is that? It's the cat shaped yokai. So that was not, that was embarrassing, because I used to pride myself on knowing like pretty much absolutely all the names of different Pokemon. And I could, like, I think at one point I had every single Pokemon name memorized, but. You know, there, there now there's like 700 or 800 Pokemon, and I don't know if I would, I don't know if I still have them all memorized or not, I don't know. I'd have to take that test, but I hope at some point I have all the yokai. The, all, I would like to have all their names memorized, that would be awesome. So, alright, decent fever time. Sweet! Finished! And we befriended and got a cola. These levels are going very well. I want to amass as much food and drinks and things as we- Oh, and an extra spirit. Food and drinks and things as I can right now because, um, yeah, I want to make sure that I have, got to make sure that I have, uh, enough for later on. You know, when you start encountering the yokai that you do want to befriend, you really need to make sure that you've got those items. All right, we're up to the boss now, and this is- Oh man, I'm gonna embarrass myself here. I know it's Snagger Jag. Is it SV Snagger Jag? I don't know the initials off the top of my head. I really don't. Okay, so I remember from the English version, um, the way to get by this boss is in the in the English version. I don't know if it's gonna be the same. He's got minions that come up on the right and left of him, and you have to destroy them right away. Um, because they heal him and give other benefits and stuff, but they're not appearing here. They kind of appeared right away. I wonder, I wonder if this is going to be different. Oh, what did he just do? He took my schmoopy. Oh yeah, and I think there was another thing he had where he... If your Wiblobs got to a certain size, he could like remove them from the playing board. So you have to try and pop... Like if you're going to grow a Wiblob, try and pop it as quickly as you can. So that he doesn't use his hook and take it out of your playing field. Because, yeah, that's not good. All right, go Poonignan. I really wish you could befriend the boss yokai. Some of them are pretty cool. I actually really like this one, Snagger Jag. It's kind of cool looking yokai. I think there was an event where you could befriend them. I remember somebody talking about that. So. Maybe later on in the game or something. All right, this is actually going swimmingly. <laughs> no pun intended. But, yeah, no, this was definitely- I did not find that this- I did not find this boss easy in the English version, but my team was significantly worse, so. And I was still learning the game. Oh, he's done. Alright, that went really well. Excellent. Thanks, Whisper. I don't know what you're saying, but I'm going to assume you're giving me the utmost of congratulations. And we get a five-star coin, which is awesome. Let's see if we get something good with the five-star coin. And we opened up the sewer levels and the next levels. That's really exciting. Okay. So I'm gonna like, use that five star coin. If I can find the right thing to put it in. Because there's only a million Krankakais. That's not the right Krankakai. Okay, oh, well, here we go. Regular Krankakai. We only have two in the English version. Can't get confused, but let's see what we get here. Oh, it looks like just a common. Oh, Cerebus. Cerebus. I wonder if this is just a standard win from the first boss, because I got the same yokai in the English version from the first boss. He, that being said, he's an A-level yokai, so probably still add him to my team. Because I think he's stronger than, uh, yeah, he's definitely stronger than some of the ones that I have right now. So. And kind of takes away from the bonus, but that being said, it's an A-level, so he'll, uh, 
he'll level up a lot more effectively. All right, let's continue on here. Head to the next world, where I believe you need to have... You've got to have level 6 no way to get through, which I don't think I do. So I think I'm going to just pay the 200 Y money and bypass the gate. When I played this in the English version, I actually leveled up no way. Um, and if you're short on if you're short on uh, Y money, you can just level up the yokai and get through the door that way. But if not, then uh, uh, let's take a quick look here. Where shall we warp to? Getting the warp function working anyways. Oh right, yeah, okay. I wanted to remember about Komazan. I think that that's Komazan. Right, because I, as I was talking to you guys about uh, opening doors, you're going to need Komazan to... Uh, I, I, I know you need him for something. I can't remember exactly what, but I should be strong enough now to try and befriend Komazan. Uh, I don't have any of his favorite foods, though. He might not befriend me. But I do have Shmoopy. So let's see if the Shmoopy, uh, the Shmoopy help is enough. I think the one on the left, I want to say it's Komazan, and the one on the right, I think it's Komajiro. I haven't been able to friend Komajiro. I think it's a lot r more rare to uh, be able to befriend that specific yokai. So. All right. <clears throat> be great to be able to befriend Komazan. If I can't, I'll just have to, uh, I'll just have to come back with his favorite food. Because I know you need him for something, and I can't remember what that is, but you need him to, uh, progress at one point, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I just googled it. It is Komajiro on the right. This is awesome. Alright, let's do this. Decent damage. Hey, we- oh, that's awesome! First try befriend Komazan. I don't remember it being quite that easy. Or what? Maybe it was the first time I did this. I can't remember. I just remember that I tried to beat him a number of times when I first started, and his level was way too high, and I got absolutely smoked. Just smoked. But that's okay. Now we just gotta get through Komajiro here, who's uh, giving me a little bit of a hard time. We're almost in fever time, though, and then I'm gonna activate all of my soul tenets. Alright, Fists of Fury. Paws of Fury, excuse me. Shouldn't say Fists of Fury, that's not accurate. Go, Schmoopy! I love this game. It's- I don't know why, I played the- I played Marvel Tsum Tsums once, which was like this kind of game, but with, uh... What is that? Is that a Swirly Bell? It looks like a swirly bell. I need that to build... Ooh, I need that to build one of the watches. Is that a swirly bell? I think it is. That actually just gave me an idea of how to get through a problem that I have in the English version of the game. Because I've been looking for the swirly bell to build one of the watches. I think it was the model Watch U. And I don't have that swirly bell, and now I know where it is. So thank you, Poony Poony, for making it even easier to beat the English version of the game. Let's take a look here. I love Komazan. I don't know if putting it on my team though makes any sense. I might just put it anyways because I love it. Yep, I think that's going to be my decision. Oh, I accidentally clicked that. This, I can't, I don't understand anything that's happening with this event, but it's pretty cool looking. Crystal Shogunyan. I heard somebody online say something about, um, as the event progresses, there's going to be, like, other yokai related to the, uh, the crystals or something. One for each different color crystal. Looks like they're having a lot of fun here talking to each other. I don't know what... Oh, I gotta pick a team. I know how to do this because of the Valentine's thing. I'm going to go with Shogun Yan. Because I like it. It looks cool. Alright, so three different teams, three different scores. This is just like the Valentine's Day event in the English game. Different rewards for different tiers. Very interesting. Level one. Polysol. Okay. See how far we can get through here. 
Gotta participate in the event a little bit. Just see what it's all about. Go, Cerebus! Alright. Oh, it's trying to teach me. It's giving me a little bit of a tutorial here. But I already got a tutorial. What, what does it want me to do here? Oh, connect them all, I see. Okay. All right. Come on, Thorn and Yon. So, if this is just like the English, you want to try and get your Wibwob close enough to that little bubble with the box in it, because it gives you extra points if you knock out the box, and that gets you extra Y points, I think, would be my assumption. I saw people doing this event online to try to get Crystal Shogun Yon, and they were grinding for Y points. So there must, I know there's some pretty, like, pretty decent pulls with this event. I'd really like to get to the 4,500 Y points so that I can crank, do the Crank Akai for 10 pulls instead of one. That would be awesome. And I saw some people getting really cool stuff. Like, they were getting, like, three golds and seven, like, you know, other decent yokai, like rank S and rank double S. Gotta participate. Okay. Well, let's go through here. All right. Play around with this guy. Wigglin? I feel like he's called Wigglin. All right. Maybe Wigglin, maybe Rhythm? I don't remember. Let's get this guy. Go! Pop all the wibble wobbles. That's not, they're not called wibble wobs in this. They're called puny puny. Which is cool. I wonder if they're based on, what are those things called? There's like a Japanese dessert. Moki? I think they're called Moki. I saw them in the my, actually, my grocery store the other day, which just kind of goes to show like how multicultural all of our grocery stores are becoming, which is awesome because I don't think there would have been a time like even 10, 15, maybe even five years ago where I walked into a grocery store and there was like Japanese themed dessert in a section of my grocery store because it's like a pretty specialty little dessert. Anyways, these uh, these Wibwabs or Puni Punis, they look just like the shape of the Moki. I never understood like quite Komazan special. He turns a bunch of balls into Komajiro, which I guess are stronger. So. Come on, come on. Let's get this guy. All right, Paws of Fury. Got him. Perfect. All right, well, I think I'm going to leave it there for today with Puni Puni. I'll do some more grinding in this event um, and hopefully save up some Y points so I can just show you guys the fun part where I put my Y points into the Oni Krankakai and get yo cool yokai pulls. So that sounds good for now. And uh, stay tuned for another Let's Play of Yokai Watch Puni Puni.